and we are taking a look at Dungeon Defenders 2 because it is releasing today on Steam and Xbox and I believe PS4 and uh, yep I am taking on the the Wyvern's Den um, I've beaten this a couple times but I've been trying to uh, um, to get what's it called a weapon for my gun witch because she's my my main character that I use oh wow actually looks a lot cooler anyway she's the main character that I use during battles um, or apprentice is talking anyways uh, yeah and I've been trying to get a gun for the gun witch but they haven't given it to me they've given me a staff see for my apprentice and they've also given me oh whoops what am I doing uh, let's see there you go they've also given me a bow for my my archer but that's not what I need so anyways let's build some turrets and let's see we're gonna go here Ooh, nice they changed the way the combat phase looked. all right so my turrets are set up and I usually use the gun witch because she's just melee combat um, so what I would like to do in this playthrough I'm hopefully I'm hopefully Hopefully, once I beat the Wavern, I will be able to get a weapon for the Gun Witch because so far I've only gotten weapons for my other characters, and I really want one for the Gun Witch. Um, usually, I play solo because I don't like playing with anybody unless it's my wife or like other family members that I know. Um, but yeah, so I will be playing solo right now. All four of my characters have reached the level 50 level cap. Which I think is, uh, I don't know if they're going to raise it now that the game is being released officially, but, uh, we'll see. So, so far so good. Um, I've played this level about four or five times now and beaten it, so I have a pretty good idea of where I want my turrets to be set. Oh my goodness! Okay, I'm spending too much time talking, and, uh, yeah, so I died. Turrets should be alright. Uh, my main characters that I'm using right now, though, are the Gun Witch, the Apprentice, and the Squire. And I named, um, I don't remember what the Archer is called. Maybe it's just the Archer. But, um, I named the Archer after Rel, -Rel which is, um, pretty good. Man, this is pretty loud. I think I'm gonna turn down the, the sound once I, once I get past this. But anyways, I named the Archer Rel, -Rel. Ooh, crap. And, uh, let's see. Hold on. Sorry, busy dispatching these things. Okay. Oh, wow. Well, heal. Build phase. Oh, man, I love that new font. Looks really good. Love the graphic quality to it. Let's update that. Let's upgrade you, upgrade you. Anyways, um, so Rel Rel is my archer. Uh, Lily Sprocket is the gun witch. I have Kieran Lore as the uh, the squire. And my apprentice is uh, Kappus. All characters from my story. And uh, yeah. I'd like to purchase one of the, the other characters, but it is so expensive. I mean, I'll flash a... Um, a screenshot of the shop and everything but I was like I am totally not gonna pay that much just to you know to get a new uh, you know character unlocked and everything like that because that's freaking redonk you know what I mean like I don't know it seems like such a waste oh my goodness okay it destroyed my stuff All right, here we go back into the combat phase, and I can't seem to turn down my, the volume on my speakers because it's going through my headphones right now, or not going through my headphones, but going through my mic, which is pretty redonk, but hopefully it's not, the sound isn't coming through on the, on the mic, but let's see, get over there. Oh, I hate these bomber guys. Take them out. Dragons. Yeah, but um, I played this maybe a week ago or so, and I'm playing the stage again, and I can tell that they've updated a bit of the graphics for it with like the, the combat phase uh, text and everything like that, and it looks pretty good. I mean, I feel like the game is shaping up for a pretty good release. 
Um, I've seen a lot of complaints about people who just aren't really happy with the build and the game and um, how everything is balanced and, you know, the amount of time that you need to grind and everything, but so far it seems okay to me. But, I mean, in most video games I seem to grind and, you know, want to try and level everything up, so that might be why I'm okay with it. But, ow, man, this is freaking loud. Good thing I only have one earbud in right now. This is just... Ugh. Let's see. Gotta wait for those little... The smaller wyverns to come out so I can blast on them. Nice! We have six more characters to go. So I'll probably just go here and gather everything. Yeah! Wave complete! Wave two. Alright. So, uh, yep. Let's build. All right, I also noticed a different change is that when you level up your turrets, instead of using just um, the up arrows, you can also see the star level now, which I think is pretty cool. Makes it a lot easier to read. Um, so, so far, a lot of the changes that I'm seeing, while they're, they're minor, it, I don't know, I feel like it's a, it's a good change. It's a welcome change. Wyverns to her aid, shoot them out of the sky. Am I not hitting him? There we go. Use enemy speed. Let's see. Take a oh! No! Explode! I don't even know what that is. Like, why your character explodes. I don't know if that's just something the game is doing, or it's something that Betsy is trying to do to you. You know, you know what I mean? Oh my goodness, really? Crap. Alright. I think I will switch to... Nope. Go back to the gun witch. Gun witch. Alright, that works too. The heck was that time bomb thing? Oh my goodness. Freaking... The egg is under attack? Really? Oh, you stupid... Oh, I got defeated? Holy crap, that was fast. I have never lost in this. Wow. Well, that actually really sucks. Okay, did they up the difficulty? I mean, this is the same way I've been attacking this place, and I've never died. So this is some pretty redonk bullshit right now. I was hoping to have a playthrough that was pretty good and I didn't have to die or, you know, start over or anything, but, uh... Damn, alright. Well... Well, that's different. Replay, please. Alright. Let's start this over. Okay, well, welcome back. I, uh... What's it called? I tried earlier and um, I lost. So we are going to try this again. Let's see, open this up. All right, build phase. All right, let's try this again. I think I might just uh, kind of skip over to maybe the second or third wave since I've uh, wasted a bit of time here. So yeah, let's uh, let's go do that. All right, here we are on phase four, and uh, yeah, hopefully I do a lot better than I did last time. See, so we want to take them out, and my goal is still to get a weapon for the Gun Witch while fighting against Betty, and uh, hopefully that's uh, that'll happen. Because uh, I would really like a new weapon for for the Gun Witch. Oh yes, let's take them out. Speed increases. Crap! Did you call her Wyverns? Yes, she did. Oh, you jerk asses! Die, suckers! Get out of here! Oh man. Here they come. 
I think it's because I let the Wyverns get through last time um, is why I died. One of the other things that I notice about Dungeon Defenders that's different than when I used to play um, a while ago is that the time it takes for the um, uh, the main base item that you need to protect, like right now I need to protect the eggs, those get destroyed really fast. Once they make it through, you've got like no time to save it. If anything gets through, you're dead. That's it. Done and done, son. Which is actually pretty crazy, but I mean, I guess it makes everything a little more tense, which is pretty good. Not bad. Makes the game fun, but so far hasn't made the game unbearable, at least uh, for me. So, yes, we have two more. It's almost time to take on Betty, son. Alright. Two more. Who the heck? Oh my gosh, what is going on over here? Alright. Sweet. Now we are in the final build phase, and we're going to have to fight. Oh, there she is. I love the design of the dragon, though. The One of the things I like most about this game is the exaggerated, cartoony look of everything. And it's, uh, it really works. I like it. I dig it. It's good stuff. All right, Betty, bring it on. Bring it on. Let's do it. All right, I no longer need those turrets, so I could probably just put those away. All right, so let's uh, speed this up and finish up the build so we can get this on. All right, let's set up some uh, arrow turrets over here. This is a thing that I, I've been doing. And uh, they'll probably patch it after they see this or something, but... Uh, yeah, Betty doesn't seem to see these turrets and attack them very much, and even if she does, she turns her back, and I can just start shooting her. And it distracts her from calling other enemies and stuff up, which is uh, pretty good. So, let's see, we've reached our defense limit, so let's keep building. All right, I think I'm ready to do this. Should be good. Uh, I will sit here and just fire on her. She can keep just... Uh, Get distracted, yes! And I can run over here and just. Big a boom! Boom! Gonna blow fire, jump out of the way. Oh crap, it got me. Okay. Yeah! Attack those turrets. Stay distracted. Stay frosty, my friends. Yes! Almost there. A little bit more. Come on! Yes! And it totally looks like I didn't get any items for the Gun Witch again. Oh man, why do they keep giving me bows and stuff? This is the fourth time. Force. This is the fourth time that I fought Betty. Oh man. Oh, oh well. There's. Is that? A, I don't know. Crimson Fury, the Flying Dragon. All right, so we killed Betty right on. So, uh, yeah, that was my Let's Play and Draw. Um, hopefully the drawing came out well. I know that the main character that I use is Lily, the Gun Witch, but I will be drawing Rel Rel as the Huntress, which is, uh, yeah. Um, instead of the, I was calling her the Archer earlier. It's technically the Huntress. So, yep. Anyways. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and all that good social media jazz. And I will be back next time with uh, um, a new Let's Play and Draw. Uh, yeah, you guys rock. Please take care. Bye. Oh, man. I can't believe I didn't get anything for the, for the Gun Witch again. Let's see. Yes! But one good thing is I keep getting dragon's eggs. All right, let's get out of here. Oh! Whoa! Cutscene. I don't remember this happening before. When the precious cargo Ooh. and its keepers are safely on board, they set off. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. I'm digging the changes um, for the Once final the update. Air, so far, I mean, it looks pretty good to me. You know what I mean? I like it. An uh, ancient being calls to him, and the apprentice Ooh. redirects the group to a place of forgotten ruins. The airship drops them off and leaves to bring the sprites and their cargo to safety.
All right, so it looks like we have a new hero, the Initiate. I likes, I digs. It's pretty hot, son. I likes. Uh, I really want the dry. Actually, I want all of them. The Dryad, the Mystic. Oh, the Lava Mancer is really cool. But I especially want the Abyss Lord. Oh, it's so good. Look at those costumes, man. Ah, oh, I want that one. Reminds me of Davy Jones. Uh, she's okay. And when I had enough, I, of course, I unlocked the gun witch. Ah. Anyways, uh, 